stings, and you will have to answer questions on what you hear. There will be time for you to read the instructions and questions, and you will have a chance to check your work. All the recordings will be played once only. The test is in four sections. At the end of the test, you will be given ten minutes to transfer your answers to an answer sheet. Now turn to section one. Section one. You will hear a man phoning to inquire about a job vacancy. First, you have some time to look at questions one to four. You will see that there is an example that has been done for you. On this occasion only, the conversation relating to this will be played first. Good evening, King's Restaurant.、Uh, good evening. I'm ringing about the job. I understand you have vacant. Oh yes. The job vacancy is at a restaurant, so. A restaurant has been written in the space. Now we shall begin. You should answer the questions as you listen, because you will not hear the recording a second time. Listen carefully and answer questions one to four. Good evening, King's Restaurant.、Uh, good evening. I'm ringing about the job. I understand you have vacant. Oh yes. I'd like to find out a few more details, if I may. Yes, of course. Can I take your name? It's Peter Chin. Okay, Peter. Well, if you want to ask about the job, and then if we're both still interested, we could arrange for you to come for an interview. <laughs> <laughs> Great, thanks. I'm afraid I missed the advert for the job, but heard about it from a friend. That's no problem at all. What would you like to know? Well, um, what sort of work is it? Washing up? It's answering the phone. Oh, right, fine. And not waiting at table. That'd be good. And how many nights a week would it be? Well, we're really only busy at the weekend. So two nights? Three actually. So it would work out at twelve hours a week. That'd be fine. It wouldn't interfere with my studies. Are you at the university? Yes. First year physics student. Oh right.、Um, and because I'm not an EU national, would I need a work permit? Yes, you would. Just get your tutor to sign it. That wouldn't be a problem if I were to get the job.、Um, where exactly is the restaurant? Well, we have two branches. The one we're recruiting for is in Hillsdon Road.、Uh, I don't know that.、Uh, how do you spell it, please? It's H I L L. S D U double N E Road. Got that. Thanks. Is it near a bus stop? Yes. The nearest one would probably be just beside the library. Oh yes, I know it. That'd be fine for me. And could I ask about the pay? We're offering four pounds forty-five an hour. That's very good. My last job was three pounds ninety-five an hour. Before you hear the rest of the conversation, you have some time to look at questions five to ten. Now listen and answer questions five to ten. We feel it's pretty good, and we also offer some good fringe benefits. Really? Well, we give you a free dinner, so you eat well. Right. 
better than hostile food. <laughs> we certainly hope so, and we also offer extra pay for working on national holidays. Oh, that's a really good perk, isn't it? Yes, we think so. And then, because of the difficulties of getting public transport, if you're working after eleven o'clock, we drive you home. Oh, that's good to know. Well, we'd certainly be interested in inviting you for an interview if you're still interested. Oh yes, certainly. Could I just also ask what qualities you're looking for? Well, for this particular job, we want a clear voice, which you obviously do have. <laughs> Thanks. And you must be able to think quickly, you know. Well, I hope I. So, when could you come in for an interview? We're actually quite quiet tonight. Uh, sorry, I couldn't come tonight or tomorrow. I'm afraid.、Uh, Thursday's okay. That'd be twenty-second of October. Fine. After five p.m. Yes, fine. Would six o'clock be okay? Perfect. And could you bring along the names of two referees? Yes, that's fine. No problem. Good. I look forward to seeing you. Oh,、uh, by the way, who should I ask for? Oh yes, of course. Sorry, my name is Samira Manuja. Uh, can you spell that, please? M A N U J A. Okay, I've got that. Thanks very much. Look forward to seeing you later on then. That is the end of section one. You now have half a minute to check your answers. Now turn to section two. Section two. You will hear part of a radio program about the opening of a new local sports shop. First, you have some time to look at questions eleven to sixteen. Now listen carefully and answer questions eleven to sixteen. Now we go to Jane, who is going to tell us about what's happening in town this weekend. Right, thanks, Andrew. And now on to what's new. And do we really need yet another sports shop in Bradcaster? Well, most of you probably know Sports World, the branch of a Danish sports goods company that opened a few years ago. It's attracted a lot of custom, and so the company has now decided to open another branch in the area. It's going to be in the shopping centre to the west of Bradcaster, so that will be good news for all of you who found the original shop in the north of the town hard to get to. I was invited to a special preview, and I can promise you, this is the ultimate in sports retailing. The whole place has been given a new minimalist look with the company's signature colours of black and red. The first three floors have a huge range of sports clothing as well as equipment, and on the top floor there's a cafe and a book and DVD section. You'll find all the well-known names as well as some less well-known ones. If they haven't got exactly what you want in stock, they promise to get it for you in ten days. Unlike the other store, where it can take up to fourteen days, they cover all the major sports, including football, tennis, and swimming. But they particularly focus on running, and they claim to have the widest range of equipment in the country. As well as that, a whole section of the third floor is devoted to sports bags, including the latest designs from the states. If you can't find what you want here, it doesn't exist. Before you hear the rest of the program, 
You have some time to look at questions 17 to 20. Now listen and answer questions 17 to 20. The shop will be open from 9am this Saturday. And if you go along to the opening, then you'll have the chance to meet the National 400 Meters running champion, Paul King, who's coming along to open the shop. And he will be staying around until about midday to chat to any fans who want to meet him and sign autographs. Then there will be a whole range of special attractions all weekend. There will be free tickets for local sporting events for the first 50 customers, and also a special competition open to all. Just answer 15 out of 20 sports questions correctly to win a signed copy of Paul King's DVD, Spring Tips, while the first person to get all the questions correct gets a year's free membership of the Bradcaster Gym. All entrants will receive a special sports calendar with details of all Bradcaster fixtures in the coming year. One of the special opening offers is a fitness test, a complete review of your cardiac fitness and muscle tone, actually done in the shop by qualified staff. This would normally cost £30, but is available at half price for this month only. There are only a limited number of places available for this, so, to make a booking, phone 560-341. In addition, if you open an account, you get lots more special offers, including the chance to try out equipment at special open evenings. That is the end of Section 2. You now have half a minute to check your answers.